Thank you so much for joining me as I share my thoughts on the film Kneecap. Why don't you just speak the Queen's English? Now, I'm not a huge fan of musical biographies only because it's pretty much the same form formulaic story, right? So you have a person that's talented and they become famous and then they get into drugs and then they either die or overcome it. So it's that usual formula that just kind of bores me after a while since we've seen it all before. But kneecap is different and leave it to the Irish to not even care. It is unapologetic sex, drugs, and rock and roll. And the band members of kneecap are the three leads in the movie. So not only the, they are musicians who never acted before in their entire life make a really good movie. <laughs> so, so honestly, kneecap is more like maybe eight mile it, kneecap is pretty much the same thing, but more like train spotting. So it really has a Danny Boyle feel. If you know Danny Boyle and movies, it's just all over the place and crazy. But these are like West Belfast Irish guys who just kind of came together and started doing Irish hip hop. And then we're talking about Irish hip hop as the language Irish, which happens to actually almost died. So what happened during the time Kneecap was becoming a band? There was legislation to try, try to preserve the indigenous language of Irish in Northern Ireland. And because of how controversial Kneecap was, they helped push that move, movement forward and really had people thinking about the importance of the Irish language itself. So it is a movie that works in weird different ways and it touches you in a way it's completely unexpected. At first you're kind of like throwing off because of all the things you're about to see because it's, like I said, fearless when it comes to the things that they do. Um, but they end up becoming this movement. And the one thing I love about this movie is just how genuine it is. And I, I don't know. Clearly, <laughs> I like the Irish culture. So, I mean, think about all the Irish music movies that are out there. Like, Commitments is a classic. Um, there's Sing Street. And, of course, my wife and I's favorite film, Once. They know how to do the music right, right? So this is no different. I think this is part of the Irish catalog for movie musicals that actually works in so many different levels because they always seem to be fighting for something. And this one, especially in Northern Ireland, they're fighting for something in a very positive way. And if you watch the movie, it's hard for me to say that because of who these band members are and what they what they do, you know. So again, the film is not like entirely a true story. It's a highly fictionalized idea of how kneecap came about. Um but it's interesting that they put this movie together with three musicians who had no idea what the film was about. In fact, they didn't even want to meet the director. The three band members are very kind of like reserved in the fact that they they protect what they have become and what they are and what they do they don't care what you think and they don't care what you know <laughs> thing is this is they are an irish hip-hop band that somehow helped create and push a movement um during a time when the irish language was about to disappear that's pretty cool and i don't know so if you like train spotting if you like eight mile and you want to put these things together this is a fun fun movie it had it is hilarious and there's just so much interesting things connected to this film that even michael fassbender shows up and it he's great so yeah i i think if you have an opportunity to go see this movie Go to the theaters or the art houses that might be showing it. I kind of think this could become a cult classic. 
So, you know, ride the wave. It is fun. Watch it in the theater because of all the, the, the sound and everything. Um, but find it any way you can because this is such an interesting and fun film. And that's all I got to say about that. <laughs> so those are just my thoughts. I'd love to hear your, your opinion on Kneecap. And if you are a fan of their music, I'd... I'm just learning now, so just let me know what you all think, and uh, yeah. <laughs> Thanks for going on this movie journey with me. Till next time. Tell me something about you, something you've never told anyone else. I'm a rubber. <laughs> <laughs>